shit, new shit, crusade, new wave, new drip, toupee, they trip, suitcase, man. What is up, guys? It's MCD at WCR, and I'm back with my good friend Ryan. Hello. For another reaction today. Today, we're going to look at something completely new, completely different. I've seen these guys mentioned several times. They've been suggested by you guys in the comments. This is a tease. Ryan, have you heard of a tease, or do you know anything about them? Never. Never heard of them, I'm afraid. So, looking forward what? to seeing what did the drill sergeant say to the K-pop band? I have no idea. At ease, gentlemen. <laughs> that is why you are a dad. Yeah, my dad would have been proud of that one, I think. I think so too. If you're new to the channel, smash that like and subscribe button because it really does me a solid. If you don't do it, I won't sleep tonight and that would be really, really sad. No <laughs> pressure, you know, you don't want that on your conscience, let's yeah. be honest. I need my beauty sleep. I need lots of it, as you can tell. Anyway, so without further ado, we're going to check out the track Crazy Form today. So let's get that up. And without further ado, Ryan, let's check this one out. Genuinely don't know what to expect. It's going to be choreo heavy, I think, looking at that. Get up. Get up. Ooh, that bass. Get up. Good man, they always get me hyped. Look at that. Some of these set extensions are wild. I like his hair. That was that was crazy form by a tease. That was fucking wild, Ryan. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, the, yeah, the, the beat, uh, the beat went really hard. 
I love the. I want that. I want that beat at my funeral, mate. Okay, I'll do. It. I'll organize it. Make sure. Put it on there. record. When you lure me into the ground, I want boom, boom, boom. boom as you're like. Yeah. As, you're as, you, go my, as you go down. As you go down. Yeah, as you're boom, placing boom, my body boom. into the soil. We go up and then it just goes back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> to come back up for an encore at the end. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, sorry. Sorry, as you were saying, I'm, yeah. I'm rudely interrupted. Stop, stop ruining it. Yeah, like the, the beat and they're dancing and they're sort of like sing, almost sing rapping. Um, just so percussive. Like um, to use the James Brown on the one, on the one every time. It was just like, bah, 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 like all the time. It's really, it was in your face, like smacking you. Um, th th this is a song for the car. I'm gonna go. I, I think I might actually go after this and go and play this. Just sit in my car park and listen to this song. Blare it on my car speakers. Um, I don't think my car could handle the bass line. No. It would rattle apart. Yeah. Like seriously. I think all the doors would come off. Um, mm. Yeah. Diss in my car. <laughs> yeah. On, I'm I'm allowed to diss my car. Okay. Yeah. It just had this real like percussiveness nature to it. Yeah, it reminded me of a song Michael Jackson does called In the Closet. Oh, where yeah, it's yeah. just quite it's quite it's just sort of like there's not a lot in terms of like instrumentation in like guitars and you know trumpets whatever um it's just sort of like drum bass and like a, a rhythm section really and that's sort of what this song has and then the vocals are sort of the instrumentation really they're the melodies throughout the song there's this crazy note that one of them did i don't know which one so maybe they can let me know in the comments but one of them did this crazy note that goes from the bridge into the chorus like this really high falsetto note and because the rest of it's quite like pitched down um you really notice the 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 bridge into the into the chorus and i think a good bridge makes an amazing chorus and um for me it just sort of elevated the chorus because you really like you, you you're rhythmically with it i mean the whole time in that video i was just literally like Argh. You know, um, mm -hmm. that's what it wanted to make me do. It wanted to make me dance, and like as we said before, like all of these, all of these um, K-pop guys do really well as they want to make they, they make you want to dance. The dancing they did was excellent. Um, I felt the energy as they were dancing. I felt their energy come through the through the video. So you know, like I imagine live, they'll make me you know make me feel the same. Yeah, I think as an introduction, these are the, like first time I've ever watched these guys. That is that is the way to. Um, you know, get onto my radar at least anyway. Um, so yeah, I, I loved it. And um, there are parallels that, you know, I think I can see in other, in other, in the other groups. And um, what I love about all of these, and, and these guys did it no different, is that you can really hear and see their influences and they bring them into the, they try and bring as many of those into the track. So obviously I mentioned yeah. MJ. Again, like his other sort of Timberland style beat for me as well. That really like low rhythm yeah, I was section. I say in the Missy, Elliott. Missy Elliott. Missy Elliott. Missy Elliott reminds me of that bass driven, just fucking groove. Yeah. Doom, doom, mm -hmm. And it's got like a bit of a dark edge, hasn't it? Yeah, it's definitely got that sort of dark. It's like, yeah, it's sort of like dark uh, drum and bass sort of style for me and the hip hop elements as well. And. Yeah, the the chorus went really hard. I was I was um, just sonically just so in tuned with with that, um, and I think like lyrically, again, doesn't need to be complicated, super complicated. I sort of got the vibe of, you know, like bra like bragging rights. You know, like look how good we can dance, look how good we can sing, look at how good this beat is. The visuals were fucking excellent. Um, I love the slow-mo sort of gunshots and stuff like that. I think you called them out during the video. Yeah, again, they're so good at syncopating what's going on with the music in the video. So they'll be like, you know, I said like some of the ad-libs, like the huh and the yeah, and, but there'll be like a gunshot and that, that'll be like one of the beats of the- Yeah, like the, a snare or something. Yeah. So good, just just um, excellent, really excellent. Yeah, I mean, for me, it's kind of like you're at this Re watching that for the first time it's kind of like you're at this really elaborate buffet and there's just so much food and like you're just like oh, I, w someone asked what is your favorite and you're like I, there's so much i love all of it it's kind of hard to identify things on one watch if that makes sense yeah the video was absolutely bananas as a bit of a video editor on the side I obviously pay attention to things like visual effects and cinematography. Some of the set extensions were fucking crazy. The transitions and stuff. There was that bit where you had the guy spinning a 360 while firing off a handgun and stuff. And you had the slowed down bullet time of the guy at the casino table. And it's just really elaborate. It's like taking all these Hollywood blockbusters and sort of 
condensing them all into a three or four minute music video like just insane to watch and really visually stimulating and exciting yeah. obviously the song itself is it very groove driven with that bass like sub bass and knock kick all the way through with the bass you know you had the hip-hop hi-hats and stuff and it it wasn't an elaborate instrumental like you say it, it just had such groove to it yeah. and i think that's what allows the choreography to shine so well you just want something that's yeah i think and, i, I yeah. think some beats like that they, they allow you to build out around them and i think some of the best songs some of the songs that i like the best are are quite simple in terms of instrumentation and then you can build around it like with the dancing yeah. and with harmonies and with like the rhythm section into the even that like slow melodic section which is one of the things that reminded me of in the closet because in in the closet there's a sort of slow down melodic section and then the bass comes in i think he uses a door or something like that i think in, in yeah, the closet yeah, yeah. to sort of reintroduce that that like low rhythm section and then they did the, they did the same thing into that sort of right section at the end where it was like the beat the, oh, beat, that, that the beat even went harder. So good. Yeah, the beat went yeah, even yeah, harder but... than the other bit. Um, I was, mate, I was like completely just in it. Um, I think that, like I, I would do something like that to provide contrast in a song because like you don't want to be going hell for leather for the entire four minutes because it kind of loses its charm. Or die. Or die. So you want, it, yeah. yeah, you want to slow it down a bit, and then when you drop it back in it, it that the emphasis and the impact I think is twice as hard. Who produced? The track do they produce the track themselves let us know down below because i want to hear more beats definitely i want to hear a tease again but i want to i want to know who their producer is is it one of them or is it an outside producer let us know down below but that was actually bonkers on first on first watch you know that was right up there for me it really blew me away and i'm gonna have to watch it again i'm sorry yeah i'm gonna have to watch it and i'm gonna listen to it again in my car repeat yeah the car test i'm gonna blare it and i don't care what people say i'm gonna be like do you know what i'm listening to I'm listening to a tease i might even sit beneath my neighbor's window and rev my engine at the same time why not that's the kind of guy I and when am. the police come you just say look i'm listening to a tease and they're gonna be like oh should have said yeah see you later they're mate. gonna groove carry on yeah no one can that gro that groove is they'll be doing like the mask you know in the scene mm -hmm. in the mask where the mm -hmm. police officers start mm -hmm. dancing they're just gonna mm -hmm. yeah, yeah they're yeah. gonna hear them they're gonna hear it then just the police officers are gonna start dancing to it in the street more people should listen to this stuff because it's just so fun it is it's very fun and like crazy talent like just the talent yeah, is yeah. unbelievable you know if these guys are on like x factor or Whatever, it, it, don't even know what there is in the UK now in terms of competitions. They would absolutely smash it to pieces. Oh yeah, hundred percent. You know when you know like in the X Factor and that where they put like people who auditioned and they put them together and made boy band. Like One Direction is like a key example of that. I, I think these guys are just way better, way better. Oh yeah, I, I don't know. Like I said in one of the first videos I did, the West is just not making music this exciting or innovative. No. And I will die on that hill. That was Crazy Form by Atiz. Thank you very much, guys, for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed the reaction as much as we enjoyed reacting to the track. Please drop some more suggestions down in the comments what you'd like to see us react to next. And please don't forget to go and check out Ryan's channel, who is also uh, running his own reaction series over there. And he would love to have you guys on board to tag along. He's very insightful and very intelligent and very interesting. Oh. That'd be ten pounds, please. Sure. Oh yeah, sure. No worries, mate. Yeah. But I will but, sleep um, if you don't subscribe. Don't worry. I'm not gonna put that okay. pressure on. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. We'll catch you on the next one. In the meantime, take care of yourselves and take care of each other. Peace. Peace. Who this? New shit. Crusade. New wave. New drip. Toupee. Day trip. Super